Balloons galore are here. Yep, balloons. You wanted balloons? More balloons? More floats? More balloonicles? More everything? Yep, the big balloon parade is right around the corner. And as they inflate, let's wait over here at our main spot for watching the balloons, that is. So here we go, and let's wait. Oh, the July Big Balloon Parade is finally here. And we've got a returning character and three brand new characters, never before seen in the parade, as well as a all new design of a returnee. So here we go. Incredible world of IMEs. Big Balloon Parade! With an even bigger layout now. So, our Mr. Robot float follows first. And this time, rather than someone sitting on it, Hagrid is on the top. He's one of our main stars in the parade. And it's always nice to see him. Is it? Yeah, it is actually. And following on is the debut of a brand new balloon and a character who is celebrating his 75th anniversary. And that is Smokey Bear, furnished by the United States Forest Service. He's holding his, a giant shovel, saying prevent forest fires because only you can stop them. And he's got the initials IME on the front. What do they mean? Oh yeah, international media entertainment, of course. IME Entertainment. But who knows why he has them on there. I have no idea. But it's still a great new addition to our parade. Our first main float is the Alien Walker float. Still, we do have really weird designs for our parade. As I said, it's like this one. Following on with some brand new pumpkins. They look tasty, don't they? As well as another parade favourite furnished by the Macy's Parade fandom site. The Robloxian. Furnished by Polar Jack as well. With some favourite characters on as well. And now here comes another character who we all like to say peek at to. And that's Pikachu from, of course, Pokemon, furnished by the Pokemon Company International. So, as they revealed, the Pokemon Sword and Shield is going to come out in November. And that means an all-new TV season and an all-new set of Pokemon in a brand new world. Pikachu is holding a Pokeball. Ash Ketchum, who owns a Pikachu, doesn't like being in Pokeballs because, well, pockets are much better for them. Our final float has now been rebuilt and it's not the final float anymore and because everyone else has moved to another one right at the very end. Oh well, at least we still have these guys on for some reason. And here is the big red shoe car with not Ronald McDonald, Captain Jack Sparrow one who always appears on this float for some odd reason. And always following that big red shoe car is our Ronald McDonald balloon furnished by McDonald's. He's here to represent the Ronald McDonald House charities and here to be bring smiles and be good to all children he meets. Wow, we can s I can already see six balloons coming up. This is going to be a quick parade, I guess. But anyways, here is the Clone Trooper float. And following it is not Kermit this time, but an all-new character. Never seen before in the parade. 
the Cookie Monster from Sesame Street, of course, furnished by Sesame Workshop. So, Cookie Monster is here with a boatload of cookies in his hand. And what's he doing here? Well, he's promoting his um, segment on Sesame Street, Cookie Monster's Foodie Truck, where he, um, alongside um, one of his Furchester Hotel friends, makes really delicious, healthy snacks for kids to enjoy. Here comes the little tree float. This is another float which um, doesn't need any explanation, but it's just a tree. Now here comes Another parade favourite, Cheer Bear and Dibble, furnished by Cloud Co Entertainment. So, Cheer Bear is the leader of the fearless Care Bears in the new show Care Bears Unlock the Magic, and Dibble is, well, Grumpy Bear's new friend and team mascot. You'll love the awesome adventures the Care Bears are on, making sure the Whiffles as well as Dibble are all fine and that the bad group don't cause any trouble. Because as they say, caring is the key to unlock the magic. It's a chicken on the plane. Cluck, 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 cluck. But just be careful that you're not the one who, um, well, gets the egg. Otherwise, you'd be hatching yourself away. And now, here comes one of our favourite parade characters and our longest running balloon ever in the parade for a character and that is Garfield furnished by Paws Incorporated. He doesn't need any explanation. You've seen the previous big balloon parades, you know what he's like. He's a big fat cat, has a friend called Pookie, lives with his owner John and Odie the dog and well has a major attitude and loves to sleep and eat his favourite food, lasagna. What more could you ask for? Now here comes another float and that's the um, what is it again? Oh yeah, it's a little single stall market Heading away. And now here comes another favourite character appearing for the second time now, and that's Curious George, furnished by Universal Studios Consumer Products Group. So Curious George is the little monkey who can, well, be as cheeky as he wants and be with his owner, the little yellow man. And he's, of course, our first monkey balloon to ever appear in the parade. Or any ape character, because, well, you can go ape, indeed, with Curious George. Complete with a hat and a nice scarf. But it's summer, though, so... You'd be feeling a little hot with those. The toy float arrives with some awesome toys along the way and a guy in a cowboy hat and yeah. And another popular character who keeps appearing is the Quick Bunny furnished by Nestle. So the Quick Bunny is basically Nesquik's mascot and here he is dressed up as a band's leader drumming his way to the beat. No, he really wants some quick right now, but don't worry, he'll get the quick he so truly deserves soon. Wow. Now, here comes the skateboarding float with none other than pepperoni on it. Yay! 
Now here comes our Peanuts float, which we always see. Snoopy, Charlie Brown and Lucy Van Pelt are on it this time, like they all normally are. And always following that is the astronaut Snoopy balloon furnished by Peanuts Worldwide. So if you can see, Snoopy's been in our parade. He's a long runner. He's been in pretty much e almost every single big balloon parade, sometimes alternating with Charlie Brown. So if you can see here, he's wearing an astronaut suit and is ready to go into outer space. Maybe the straws could release him, but that doesn't matter. As we've said before, Snoopy can dream into anything he'd like, even being in our parade. What a lot of fun. They're about to work, save the world before bedtime again. Yep, it's the Powerpuff Girls. And what are they doing? Well, just being their usual selves, of course. Now here comes another parade favourite, SpongeBob SquarePants, furnished by Nickelodeon. So you've seen him with his new TV special that's celebrating his 20th anniversary. How old could, could a sponge like him be? Surprising, isn't it? But it's nice that we always like to see Spongebob in our parade, making sure that we get a good laugh. And following on is Spongebob the minifigure and Sandy Cheeks on this speedboat. There they go. Following on that is the Brian the Bunny Rabbit Balloonicle. This time it seems like Brian's missing an ear. It's furnished by Mayday 51 by the way. Balloonicles don't need to be lifted up by straws. All they need is a little Lego stand and then they can move on their own. Well, here comes None other than Batman and Superman. Oh, and a giant big smiley face balloon, which we've seen before. So, and then here comes another interesting float. It's a little vehicle. With Boko Loco, Buzzy, and um, a farmer on it. The next balloon though, we can only show you on tape right now. So the balloon that's missing in action is Sonic the Hedgehog, this exact design. So Sonic is furnished by Sega of America, or Sega of Europe, and well, he's a spiky blue speedster, ready to speed along and mow down his enemies. He's got a giant nose and he's flying high. Well, except the fact that He's not in our parade after he deflated, but oh well. At least we still get to see him anyway. See you later, Sonic. Well, at least novelty balloons that followed the um, Sonic survived. And they're Harold the Fireman and Harold the Policeman. Oh. And continuing on is the ATO Adventures crew, except for Lewis again, because he's still not there. Aaron, Sen, and um, Chase are here instead, though. But that's still going to be a lot of fun. I wonder what their next episode will be, if they'll ever make one, that is. Now, coming up next for the parade is, the, is an entire Disney section, consisting of... Four balloons and a bunch of floats. And it's starting off with a popular favourite balloon, Kermit the Frog, furnished by the Walt Disney Company. So if you can see, Kermit is green with envy. And in a good way, because he's a frog after all, and I bet Miss Piggy wants to grab him too and marry him once and for all. As I said before, Kermit is a popular sight in our parade. He's normally behind the clone trooper float, or sometimes he's near the end of the parade, but this time he's not near the end in sort of way he is, but he's not. 
Good old Kermy. Another Disney float in this section is the infamous Star Wars float, which we've seen for a couple of parades now. It's one of our longest floats and is two floats connected to one with all sorts of styles, characters and vehicles on it. And here's a character who takes the anger into anger and is here for the first time in, since 2017 in our parade and that is Disney's Donald Duck, of course, as I said, furnished by the Walt Disney Company. Donald's here to complement his pal Mickey Mouse. Because who else would you say um, needs a bit of time with each other? Well, seems like Donald and Mickey do. And that's a nice thing. Welcome back, Donald. What does it normally mean when we see Mickey Mouse and Minnie in the parade? Well, it means that there's another Disney character on the loose. And that is a popular one that we're going to see, Mickey Mouse himself. Furnished by the Walt Disney Company as well. Mickey is a popular sight in our parade and as you've seen, Donald's following him now as part of this Disney section of the Big Balloon Parade. Mickey's got large ears and he's always a popular favourite in our parade. One of our most popular, actually. And that's why we always like seeing Mickey in the parade, no matter what he is. And speaking of Mickey Mouse and friends' favourites, Goofy and Minnie Mouse are oh, back again as balloonicles. The Donald one did join them this time for obvious reasons, but... They dance along and well, around like balloonicles always do. Also furnished by Disney. And now coming up is the Walt Disney World, Walt Disneyland, I mean Disneyland Paris. Let's just say Disney Parks. Castle float. Featuring all your favourite Marvel characters. And a popular favourite as well. Who could that be? Clinging on to Spider-Man. Hmm, who could you guess it would be? Well, maybe his bottom gives it all away. And his hand. And web stinger, yep. Spidey is back. Furnished by Marvel Entertainment Group. So... Spider-Man starred in Spider-Man Far From Home, which is still in cinemas as of when this parade is broadcast, and, well, he's unleashing his webs all over the world. He's still popular to this day, alongside the Disney XD Spider-Man cartoon series. Spider-Man and Spider-Man. Maybe you could Spider-Go. Well, the parade's almost over now, and if you can see, we've got two giant character balloons left. One of them a brand new one, never before seen. So, here is one of them, and that is a Simpsons float, which we always like seeing in the parade. Bart's on the back, and a couple of characters are all on the other sides. Here is Sunny the Snowpow, a balloonicle which can spin around and the elves are on the back. It's a bit like a float balloon, to be honest with you. But it can move on its own and looks like a balloonical, so... Let's call it a balloonical. And then here comes the Percy the Penguin balloon. A popular sight we've seen in a few big balloon parades for now. And this time we have a 
police officer and a pilot. Strange, isn't it? And now here comes Spaceman. For the second time now, Macy's has furnished the hit one of their popular balloon favorites from the 1950s in our big balloon parade. He's holding this air intake and he's all blocky like a Robloxian. Maybe he is a Robloxian, but I don't know. But he's rising in the air. Maybe for a making sure he doesn't have a crash landing. Uh oh, the villains are on the loose. Yep, you saw the villains. Now they're there with the mega, mega humble machine, the skeleton horse, and um, Lord Moles. Awesome. Gun with Lord Vader on the back, the main villain of ATOM Adventures. And who is he actually supposed to be? We'll might we'll probably never know. One of our newest characters and our very last character of the balloon in this um big balloon parade is Bob the Minion, furnished by Illumination Entertainment. So Bob's holding his beloved Teddy Tim as they fly up the air. They look very cool in balloon form, and we hope to see them again, because um, the new Minions movie is coming out next year, so what will Bob do? Who knows? And then here's the Panda Bear balloon. And then here is the float that normally is used by the ATO Adventures crew, but here, Snap Lock, it's riding it again. Making sure he looks as cool as possible. There's Toy Soldier, our one of our last balloons, and our last major float is this one, full of various different characters. Some of them you might recognise, some of them you might not recognise. And now it comes to the grand big finale again. Yep, you've seen what it is. And, ready? The Once Upon a Mattress crew are here, as per usual. This time, the winner Fred is finally back. And there they go. And then here comes the Snow Family float, the last float in our parade this time. And there I am with James. I have a microphone so you don't hear him, but oh well, you get the idea. Heron's in the middle, as well as Oscar Barnett and Ben Bryan. And well, well, let's say something, haven't we? Let me just move to the front. James can stand here. Erin can. Erin, you stand here. Oscar Barnett. You stand there, and Ben Bryan, stand here. Yep. Thank you for watching another edition of the Big Balloon Parade. The end. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye.